Tonight at long last, the SpaceX rocket is scheduled to blast off from Florida, hopefully clearing the way for the long-awaited homecoming of two stranded astronauts. Mark Strassman is at Kennedy Space Center. Mark, good morning. Morning, Tony. Butch and Sonny's space odyssey is almost over. In just a few hours, their replacements will climb aboard a SpaceX Crew Dragon for a 10-hour flight to the International Space Station. Veteran astronaut, NASA astronaut Anne McLean is the mission's commander, joining her are crewmates from the United States, Japan, and Russia. Wilmore and Williams have been at the space station since June. Their stay was extended after their ride home. A Boeing Starliner spacecraft developed propulsion problems during its test flight. NASA decided to return Starliner empty and keep Williams Wilmore and Williams at the ISS. President Trump and SpaceX founder Elon Musk have claimed Wilmore and Williams were abandoned for months in space by the Biden administration. Musk said he offered to bring the pair home sooner, but NASA has said it never considered that as a viable option. The astronauts have said they don't feel abandoned or stuck in space, that it's just part of the job. And if tonight's launch goes as expected, Wilmore and Williams could begin their overdue trip home as soon as Sunday aboard a SpaceX Crew Dragon appropriately named Freedom. Tony? Very appropriately named, Mark. Thank you very much. Appreciate it. We're rooting for him.